Butterflies comes in all shapes, colors, and sizes. Scientists have recently discovered that butterflies have been on the earth for approximately 200 million years. Butterfly fossils have been found all over the earth that show these beautiful insects history. We sometimes forget that a butterfly is an insect. This is because of their impressive, majestic beauty. Most people think of the word insect and incorporate it with creepy crawling things that can bite you. When butterflies are young, people realize that they are definitely insects because they have multiple legs to creep and crawl around the earth. This is when they are young caterpillars. Caterpillars are eating machines. They will increase their body weight hundreds or thousands of times. When a caterpillar is young, that is the most dangerous stage in its life cycle, as the mortality rates are very high. Caterpillars are subject to weather, disease, pesticides, and predators. Caterpillars have soft bodies and varies of all sizes, ranging from one millimeter to up to 14 centimeters. They have three body parts, the head, the thorax, and the abdominum. The thorax is the second section of the caterpillar's body that contains the legs. Their eyes are able to differentiate the light and dark, but not detect images. Their heads can move side to side. They also most times have tiny hairs all over their bodies. They also have up to 4,000 muscles in their body. Their head alone has up to 248 muscles. Caterpillars can produce silk using their glands which they use to build a cocoon. When the caterpillar is fully grown, it finds a safe place to build a cocoon. It prepares a silk mat, then attaches itself to the silk mat. The caterpillar allows itself to drop and then it hangs there, upside down, transformed into a beautiful butterfly. Inside the cocoon, the butterfly loses its mouth and it is replaced with a straw-like tongue which will be used to consume the nectar. Never again will it eat solid food. This creepy, crawling creature transforms to become a beautiful butterfly. The new butterfly will now have three pairs of legs, not eight like it had as a caterpillar. Its eyesight will improve and its eyes will be quite larger. And all this happened in just 10 to 14 days. Butterflies are cold blooded and need the light from the sun to warm the muscles they use to fly with. The plants they thrive on need full direct sun to produce enough nectar. You can create nectar also, simply just taking some apples, oranges, or bananas and placing them in the sun. The butterflies will find them. Butterflies taste with their feet. Remember, only use organic fruits as the pesticides don't care about how beautiful the butterflies are. It will kill them. Butterflies can make your yard or landscape more enjoyable. We should remember that they should be cared for. We should strive to have a pesticide free yard to protect our children, family members, pets, and these needed insects. It is so peaceful watching butterflies swoop, bask, and flutter like ballerinas performing their antics across a yard or an open space in the wild. Just take a look at these beautiful, majestic butterflies.
When the sun comes out, butterflies appear. They are only interested in doing two things, eating and reproducing. Butterflies fly most between 9.30 a.m. and 12 noon in the morning and between 2 p.m. and 3 p.m. in the afternoon. Butterflies need temperatures of about 85 degrees Fahrenheit to fly. Since they're cold-blooded insects, they can't control their body temperatures. If the temperature is below 55, most butterflies can't fly. This enables them to fly away from predators or feed. Temperatures between 82 and 100 degrees Fahrenheit, butterflies can fly with ease. Butterflies' wings are transparent with layers of thousands of tiny scales covering the wings which reflect light in different colors. Butterflies rely on their eyesight for several tasks like finding mates and flowers to feed on. Butterflies can see ultraviolet colors that humans can't see with the naked eye. Some butterfly wings have ultraviolet colors markings which help them identify other butterflies of the same species. This helps them to find a mate. Butterflies sip moisture from puddles or from wet soil. This has salt in it that has dissolved in the water which is needed to increase a butterfly's fertility. Butterflies lay their eggs on specific plants. They are particular in finding the perfect plant to do so. We hope you enjoyed our video on butterflies. If you like the video, please press the like button and subscribe to the channel. This is a relaxation and nature channel. Hopefully we'll see you next time. Thank you.